All right, hey everyone. Today I'm going to talk about the Eugene real estate market, and we're going to specifically look at homes between $300,000 and $600,000 that sold over the past 12 months. All right, let's jump in. The first thing I'm going to talk about is regarding the amount of cash buyers in the market. There was actually, this past 12 months in comparison to the previous 12 months in 2020, there was actually a 2% increase in the amount of cash buyers that actually closed on transactions. So while that might seem like an insignificant number, the overall number of cash transactions in this price range was actually at 18% over the past 12 months, which is significant if you're a typical buyer that's using, say, a conventional loan or an FHA loan. There's going to be a decent amount of competition from those cash buyers. The second thing I'd like to talk about is regarding the actual purchase price of homes in this price range. What's interesting is many buyers will think that the asking price is going to be the final sales price of the home. However, that's oftentimes not the case. From spring of 2021 until the fall of 2021, what we saw was on average 10 to $15,000 being the amount of money above asking that buyers had to offer in order to have their offers accepted and in order to close on the home. So 10 to $15,000 additional above the listing or asking price of the seller. So that means a little bit more money out of your pocket. The next thing I'm going to talk about is the months of inventory. What's interesting here is that on average over the past 12 months, there were only 0.4 months of inventory. And what that means is that at any given moment, there was roughly half as many homes available for sale as sold during the entire previous month. So that can also lead to more competition um, with many buyers in the market. Next, let's, let's talk about the overall days on market. From spring of 2021 until fall of 2021, what we saw was the average of less than 20 days on market for homes that were available until they went under contract. So homes were moving or selling very, very quickly. And what that means for you as the buyer is you need to make sure to be pre-approved from a qualified lender before seriously looking at homes to make sure if you identify or find a home that you really like, that you can quickly make a move on it and get an offer submitted and ultimately accepted. So those are a few things I wanted to talk about today with you. I hope that was useful and informative. If you have any additional questions about anything real estate related in the Eugene area, Springfield, or surrounding cities, don't hesitate to reach out. Here's my number, and I'll do whatever I can to assist.